We're back at the happy hunting ground. The peat, this is all peat. I got the little coal on today. There's Mr. Denny. And Mr. Low Tide Tim is with us today. Stand by. So far I've dug two more of these. We got a nice 12, 23 here. I dug some more bullets, a penny. A 22 casing. I think we got it. Peat moss. What lies beneath? Probably a 22. Oh, it's a big bullet. Like a 9 millimeter or something. Look. <laughs> it comes to Tide, we'll see how he's making out. How you making out, Tide? Got a quarter, a penny, two pennies, a piece of wire, and that's. Then he's got a gold and a silver. Has it really? Yeah. Ah. Gold's got ice in it. Gold and ice for a Bumbles man. Damn, we got the Bumbles again today. Yeah, I didn't find anything. I, just, I got one target, two targets in the water, both of them were pennies. I got a lot of bullets back that way. And a couple quarter, I mean a, a dime, I think, and a couple pennies and some odds and ends, but no kind of bling. A gold and a silver the Bumbles man's got. Yes, sir. Good God, you put it on us today. Again. Again. Well, we better go back that way. Yeah. I got nothing down this way. Yeah, I just want to hunt that little slough behind me. All right, let's beat feet that way. I see something shiny right there. It looks like a spoon. But then it looks like something's attached to it. Or maybe it's two things. Stand by, let's pick it up. Oh, yeah, it is two things. It's a piece of an old fork. And, and then this piece of stainless. See, there's a life raft. It's in bad shape. Uh, it's not a life raft, but a swimming raft. You know what I mean? I don't know if you can see it or not, but there's a black, looks like a quarter. I'm pretty sure it's not a quarter, but right next to it, buried in that edge of that rock is a penny. I've been trying to get it out for five minutes. Stand by. I just now got it uncovered. Well, I got the penny out. Let's see what the other thing is. Well, right here yesterday, there were three big piles of rocks. If you remember, I think I showed them to you. Three big piles, piled right up. Today, there's not any. They're covered up. That's at least a foot or two of sand that's moved in here since last night. It's amazing, isn't it? Finally, ringing the scoop. I'm only one behind. Looks like a silver ticket from here. Stand by. Yeah, silver. I got just a silver ring. Silver. But Timmy says you've got the mumbles on us again today. There's some old, it's a little silver and a. And then it's got some ice in it, though, isn't it? Yep. Let's get it out here in the sunshine where we can see it. We'll get it out there. Bobby said uh, a little west of us looks good. He said Rich got that other ring. Yeah, I heard found that yesterday. out. This is a nice little ring. Diamonds are shining too. Yep, I think it's real. Yeah. It's like 14K in, in there, I think. So you find 14, 18, eh? <laughs> 22. Like I don't get a whole lot of pins. <laughs> I'm a little low on pins. Don't put. Holy jumping Toledo. Now that's dark right there, buddy. The mumbles man. I got another piece in here too. Let's 
Got something right there, but I'll be damned if I can make it out on that end. Got something right there too, but I can't make it out. Oh, that says Italy. I think that says 14K Italy. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what it says. Now I got this. Mumbles man's got all kinds of gold today. I couldn't find gold in Zales. <laughs> <laughs> It's got that clasp on it. it. Looks like it's a good one. Yeah, that's where the mark is, I think, probably on the clasp. I'll have to get the tiny magnifier right for that. But that's a nice cross. I found all that, and I got a silver bracelet in it, too. It's so small, I'll never find it. You got a little bracelet like I got yesterday. Silver. I found all that in that, in that slew there past that greenhouse. Lady come out holler at you? No. <laughs> There's a guy out there fixing the stuff. Piece of peat right here. It's got something in it. I can't find it on top around the edges, but let's put it down there and break it up. 1236. Probably a bullet. Eliminate that piece. Eliminate that piece. It's in that piece. I'm like I'm relic hunting now. I think I found it. Damn. You don't believe what it is. I don't know if it's a sinker or a piece of. A round ball. <laughs> Old as this place is, it could be a round ball. But that's what it is, a big round hunk of lead. I'm working up from this slough on the top of this little ridge right here. I got a lot of coins. I got a buffalo. First buffalo in a while. Ooh. Might have been a silver spoon in his day. One of my old rounded end for, uh, knives. I like it. Well, that little piece of peat right there was hiding that. I don't know if it's the top of a ring or a pin. Something all, all for Christ. All for Christ. Looks like it had a little clip on the back, you know. Pretty cool. That might be the best ticket of the day for me. Other than the buffalo. Anyway, we're putting our stuff back. Almost man got a low one, Timmy says. Oh yeah, I see it. I see it shining on there. It's sort of like that one you got yesterday, yeah. a bit smaller. Mm -hmm. It's got hearts on it. Stainless, I think, like you said. There's, there's some writing in it. It's too light to be any anything good. Then he found my watch. That was good. <laughs> I think it says stainless. I can see it right there. Yep. They found stainless right there. steel right there. It's a nice little taquito. And Timmy found a half. A Franklin. That's it. Found some change. 1957. Silver. What? What is it? 57. So here's a roundup. And I got gold. I didn't know it. Remember that little religious doodad thing right there? You see a better picture of it. 14K. Good God almighty. Got a 40 nickel. Buffalo. Can't make the date out. And a 62 Rosie. And I. That's just about it. Some crap, you know. Look at those 22s. That's why I bought that scoop. Just for this spot. Paid off today. I did a lot of digging. The wrong kind of digging. But 
at least I got some of them good sounding tickets out of the way so we won't have to fall through your scoop and dig them again. Look at that. Look at them little no good womb bats. God. Sometimes it's all cases. And lately it's just been bullets. What a pain they are. They sound so good. And 90, I'd say 99% of these came from on top of that peat. You know, just buried under the wafer of sand. You can't even see them. So you got to dig down in that damn peat and then dump them out on the bank to find them. What a pain they are. Ah, but it was a good spin. I mean, you know, the Mumbles man, he, he blowed our dresses up big time today. That old Mumbles man. They ought to take his CTX away from him. Let him use his Excalibur. Maybe we'd have a chance. <laughs> Maybe, I said. Okay. See you tomorrow. If it don't, it's supposed to rain, but I think we'll probably go anyway. What do you think? Mumble man will be charging. As long as that. Good luck, everybody. I see you.